finally find it. Finally! So of course, we're back with another definitely not video. So of course, though, I was really busy today. Who was the video? Um, just today in general, today I'm supporting. Um, I was really busy today. I'm half tired a little bit though. So of course, we got the Beach of Beats info. I was gonna do this a day later, but I was like, you know what? I'm gonna record it, get done out the way though. Of course, but yeah. Um, yeah, we got Beach of Beats, of course, right now for, um, Zane Day, uh, not Zane Day, but for, um, the new Pinton Battle update, but uh, JP just got it, stuff like that. It's not version Z, they would have said it. It was version G, because it showed off the Dragon Balls game about hour, I believe, last weekend or the weekend before. That is him recording. Um, because yeah, I don't know when we upload the video. Hopefully, I'm gonna try to get it out by Thursday. No, Friday. I'm gonna try to at least get the video out by Friday, I wanna say. I'll try to at least get it out by Friday. So, yeah, because I got other videos to edit and do stuff like that. So, I just realized that now I got a lot to do. So, yeah. Um, that's how much I heard with, with this video, though. It's simple because we already kind of know. And Legends getting a new thing as well. So, yeah, again, it's probably will be super, super short. I'll try to keep it super, super short as I can. So, of course, this is a Battle update. We already know about this TV um, characters and stuff like that. Jimmy just had an update about it and stuff like that. That's pretty much, if you want to go see that video, it was somewhere around me because I kind of, um, of course, um, it's a little bit hot right here. Um, I re pretty much already went over all this stuff and of course like that. Um, it's, it's going kind of new right here, just the full skin slash details. It seems like this is all new to me, so I don't know what it's kind of about though. So it seems like this is your kind of like stamina gauge bar time you have left. And these are the news I guess you can use how much health and attack power they have left as well. It seems like that. Um, that's why I kind of just get this ass. I have no idea what it's about. It seems like there's a time limit right there. Again, I don't know anything about this. It has a new map, so I think there's like a Arctic slash Glacier Land. I know it's the Wasteland. This is, um, the um, other green Wasteland or the island. Um, from like all the other Dragon Ball games. That's why I kind of, um, noticed it from, from, from the stuff like that. So, I kind of get that. So, some little bit of confirmation slash, um, stuff over here. So, yeah, that's why I kind of see it as. Yeah, it seems like you can use all the um, cards that were displayed before. These are just like rare cards and stuff like that, so I guess you can swim any card. I guess the higher, because I know the higher rated characters like Ella Doku is really good. Um, Name it Super Saiyan Goku is really good. Again, this is the card that actually uses all cheating and stuff like that, which is cool. Again, it's supposed to be like another way of your characters going out on adventures, I guess. Um, for, it's like kind of like Legends where characters go on adventures. It's basically supposed to be like a mode specifically, like, I think they specified this as well. Uh, or like people are just speculating and get talking about specifically Pinta Battle to be like a big big update for you to like use your units out like use these guys outside like you know, if you're not playing the game or whatever you use these units and stuff like that so number one it seems right here is going to be like characters you can use and stuff like that right here like all the rare characters and stuff like that it seems like they're going to be like super chibi just for this mode of course you can select your difficulty and stuff like that again this is how Legend is too you can select like any other event you can select like multiple adventures and like do different other adventures um if you don't play Legends or whatever you can have select adventures you can play it outside the game we again though like some of them are like what like 30 minutes or 20 minutes or up to an hour at least um i gotta do that as well um again it's supposed to be like a mode like outside the game or something like that like, it seems like they're gonna be like different of course like this one like the blue one the blue energy capsule right here for healing uh, i feel like this kind of like the first area and this one be orange compared to the next area like the wasteland the third one could be like you know like red or for the glaciers and etc etc it seems like that but it looks like it's gonna be like off the home screen from the like, completely different thing but yeah um they put it like a kind of little bit tv art style right here it seems like um, the character it seems like this button right here is like a random kind of button right there or like whatever unit you have i guess unlocks the difficulty right here it seems like that but um i don't know just yet though so yeah i seems like i guess if you have that kind of character you can access it or whatever you access like this type of thing right here um, i guess it's all the units you can select or whatever you have available you can just go ahead and select and fight it it seems like it's gonna be like that and the fourth one i guess is like how your deck how you're structured and we don't know nothing about this it seems like this is gonna kind of change the game book with just a little bit again we don't know ever everything team everything the detail about it i mean we do know but actually no we know but then there's so much stuff going on with the fighting system right there yeah it seems like your characters go up here and like the characters you have left or down here as well and, like there's um kind of like you have to get a time limit right there so if characters kind of do it yeah, it does have a time it seems like it has a time limit or time's going down or up i don't know what it's gonna be about though but it seems like it's gonna have potential for any it seems like it's gonna be um, like that around there and of course down here we got some new news right here for saying day um i guess to kind of stick this in because it does it does all the time with legends they did it last time with legends i believe or the time before um I might be in like July or I think February's V jump where basically we had like UI Goku login bonus. I think it's January. We had like the UI Goku like you know login bonus unit for a six year anniversary. Um, UI Master Sign um, or Master UI Goku is someone so for Harry. Everybody has Master. Everybody says UI Sign. Everybody had different per preferences, boys and girls. Hi everybody. So um yeah, I'm just like other boys gonna get his easy A right here. So again, that's pretty cool and stuff like that. I'm um, actually like that though, so yeah. I mean, we already know about this already for saying day, so it's time to shove it in. Because when I really saw these beat up loops last night, I was like, 
Wait a minute, why did I put this here? So yeah, um, it seems like all this stuff is gonna be um, just again really crazy because we I mean, we know like how it's gonna be structured. I had full details and breakdown, but we don't know how it's gonna like be and stuff like that, like actual end game. It seems like it's gonna be like a fun little mode. It seems like yeah, you can get any potential orbs again. Stuff that again, this is just like kind of like a big thing you could do outside your game, not playing the game. So you know, if you're a casual player, you just want to be like, okay, I want to do this, this, that, that, you know, while I'm out in the game. Either the difficulty is probably there to be like, okay, your character right is gonna be like right here. Um, fighting this character, you know, depending on how many cards or you know how strong it is. Those cards you have different rarities, like LR Goku has a different rarity. Things like platinum is like super effective or whatever, like LR Frieza, LR STR Frieza has like, you know, um like platinum and like you know superpowers or whatever. Um something like that. Of course Namek Super Saiyan Goku is a transforming one. They have like his regular chibi kind of little form, then we have like a Super Saiyan form. We got some other chibi characters as well, like the um eight support units from Namek. It was Gohan. Gohan, Gohan, and of course Vegeta. Oh, we got Kyle Scott, the whole game force up there, the Umbrella game force, and stuff like that. Again, there's just so much for Pinta Battle right now. There's just so much on the first Vita, but of course, um, kind of explaining and breaking it down a lot. Again, we don't know what it's going to be about and stuff like that. It's just, they're just, it's like literally just so much here we don't even know about. Again, when we see, it, I still want to see the kind of the gameplay, kind of break it down. Because for global, this pilot probably will probably be like in like a month. Or like a couple of days or whatever, um, not a couple of days, but like a month or two, whatever. Those global pushes updates pretty, pretty not late, but they push them pretty, pretty early. So again, I'm right, it can be like right now. Then when it comes up, we will um, kind of know everything because we're gonna have like log mode screen, a clear screen, like you know, log mode screen, like the whole like, you know, um, screen where you um basically um the screen where you basically um try to think of it, um where you. Um, clear stage and stuff like that. It'll be like, I'm not clear stage, but we for interface in battle. Um, we had a logger bonus, so of course, seems like it's gonna have his like own kind of logger bonus structure. I believe it. Am I? Blah, blah. Oh, I was gonna cut it for a second, so yeah. Um, so that was gonna be structured like that, but yeah, of course, LR Bros. Easy as can be the same day, so I guess I can kind of push that in, but oh, yeah, by the way, same day is happening. Nobody? Okay. Um, that's how it's gonna be structured again. That's um the full kind of purpose, I guess, we're kind of getting with this. Again, we don't know too much. I'm just kind of speculating because going off it because again, I don't read really Japanese. I kind of just see the translations and stuff like that. And of course, right here, but right here for Legends, if you follow some Legends content right here, um, GT um Super Seventeen, it's, 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 it's Super Seventeen, the green one. Oh, you green ones getting um Zenkai. So yeah, another green Zenkai unit for regen. And of course, I don't, I don't think it's on regen. I think it's really for more androids and GT. You guys are trying to break the team back though, so yeah, that's pretty much kind of for those scans and stuff like that, of course. I think they're here just, um, you know, oh yeah, here's a free Zenkai for Super Zen Goku. I think I think Red Gojis with Zenkai was announced in the V-Jump as well. I know Buhan, last V-Jump we got the details, not details, but we got info that um, Demon King Pickle was coming. Um, the trans new transforming Demon King Pickle was coming. I've not done a breakdown video at all yet. I just like to take a break from recording, then just to you know kind of, um, think about those maybe next week or whatever, because I have some back up with so many Legends videos. Um, Oh, well, we already know this guy who's getting Zenkai already, you know, for free, it's all that. I was kind of just mentioning that. Um, back on the DBZ Kakarot side, um, we are getting, I'm um, just kind of throwing in a little bit. Um, new Android 17, um, 18, of course, being the whole future Trunks Park and stuff like that, of course. Out uh, here, this is all screenshots. These are completely new screenshots. Some of again, Android 17 is going to be there. We are. We kind of the um, Symphonic Dance right there. And of course, the tech that kills Gohan right there. I'm um, that's going to have it. Of course, I do mention down here as well that the, um, this is, um, I think, chapter 33 of the manga. Basically, Trunks' story and stuff like that. Basically, just going through the whole Trunks arc and stuff like that. Covering the future Trunks arc. We have the team future Trunks that's going to be available. And of course, future Gohan's going to be available as well. We can see his gameplay back there a little bit. Again, it's just little stuff like that. Of course, it's going through the whole story and stuff like that. It's going to look nice, beautiful, awesome. So, we're saying future Gohan's back there with the one arm. So, of course, it's really, it's really for Japan to show this type of thing because in Japan, separate arms and separate legs are not allowed in games. Because Legends is the first ever, I think, Dragon Ball game just in general to do it. Besides the Bujigiri match, they did that as well, I believe. I don't know what Legends, I guess they got a pass for it in Japan, because Global, it's, it's okay, but having several art like in Japan, it actually, like, people don't make fun of that, because they do take that seriously. It's not really kind of fun about that, so they don't really, like, put in fun of that, though, so yeah. Again, it's pretty much it for the B-Jump stuff this time around. Again, I want to kind of make this really quick and stuff like that. I get to talk a little bit fast a little bit, because again, I'm so excited for these videos. It's just insane this right now. So yeah, of course, one more little thing. Today is my birthday, so, oh, okay, let me do that. Yeah, so let's see, come to the screen. Yay! I kind of like to put that on screen for a little while, so yeah. Um, hopefully that ends up the video or whatever. So yeah, DBZ Cat Grots, of course, getting the future trunk stuff. Uh, we did specifically say the manga down there. I said the history of trunks. Um, 17, of course, it's green 17 is getting a Zenkai. We've got a free Zenkai unit for, of course, um, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and of course we got um, Pinto Battle, more Pinto Battle stuff. Super Saiyan 3 Broly's getting ZDA, um, no, Super Saiyan Broly, I wish. Super, I mean, he did, but it was kind of tough. But, so, besides going to the 
yeah, Pinto Battle update, of course, with the full um, more details down here. Then, of course, we got, um, of course, LR, STR, Bully, King, ZZA, and stuff like that. So, yeah. So, you guys, there, though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great I'll go down again, though. Make sure you always stay safe. Wash your hands. God bless all of you. If you're going out, point to wear a mask. Please, go to some toilet paper if you need it. I'm kidding, though. Go to the bathroom or restaurant if you need to do that. So, what do you guys think about this course? update? Do you like it? Do you hate it? We got lots of new stuff, of course, with a, a Pinto Battle update. Do you like it? I like the idea of doing stuff outside the game, not playing it. I would love that too, just kind of do something different. Um, yeah, again, if you don't feel like just kind of playing the game sometimes, maybe you want to exit. You know, maybe play a different game, but oh yeah, I'm going to play Legends, you know, get some adventures done. Or maybe switch it up, play Dokken, get some, you know, adventures done with the Pinto Battle update. Again, we don't know too, too much about it, though, but we are slowly getting details. I love VTube Kyle kind of, I love how VTube kind of puts out a little bit, helping out a little bit. Not helping out players, but just in general, though, just helping out with the whole Pinto Battle update. It's kind of pushing it a little bit more here, because it seems like they're going to do a lot more. Pinto Battle, I've always succeeded, but I kind of failed a little bit, because I feel like they're kind of just done with that, honestly, though. It turned out great, but at the same time, you know, using the units are kind of bad. Otherwise, Champ Battle's pretty good, though, honestly, in my opinion. I'll um, guess we'll that other videos later. So, yeah, see you guys again, though. Peace out.